Hi, this is Brandon with GoToWP. I wanted to post a quick screencast to show you uh, the latest version, what we've been working on. Uh, so here is the two cool new features that we have decided to add. Um, we're, we've decided to merge the premium version with the Woo add-on. There's just been too much uh, diverging support needs for both of those. So we decided to put the features together um, and create a faster way to create your stores so that you can sell your webinars. Um, to date, it's been very manual, uh, especially with the Woo add-on. You've had to copy and paste into uh, copy and paste the the long number from the GoTo webinar, GoTo training site over into your WooCommerce area. So we decided to eliminate that. Uh, what I'm going to show you real quick here is. Uh, if you go to pages, you'll see there's cart, checkout, my account shop, which are the WooCommerce ones. Um, and if you go to the go to uh, WP settings and go to the webinar, you'll notice that I have six webinars set up here. We're pulling in the description now, which is new, um, and that'll show up on your site. But the cool thing that we've done is if you don't want to use WooCommerce, you simply create this you click this create standalone webinar shop. Um, go ahead and click that button and it will update to say shop is created. And if you go over here to the pages, you now have a page called webinars, which if you view, it's cr automatically created a page with all of those webinars um, on the page and you can click to register and it'll just drop down and they can register right there for that particular webinar. Um, we've added a couple layout options. Um, so for, if you go to the training, you see half page, uh, half, one third, and, or one fourth. So say we wanted to go to look at the one third, you'd save. And you could go back here and refresh, and now it's showing them three wide, and it would be the same if you showed it one fourth. So, that is a cool way to quickly set up your shop so that you're selling your webinars. Um, you can still use the list short code, this type single type list. You can still use that if you want to put something on a post or an individual page. Um, but if you do want to create a, a shop, um, you can do that. Alternatively, if you would like to create the WooCommerce products, let's say that you're using WooCommerce, you can do the same thing here where you click the create WooCommerce products and then if you go and look at the products, it's created webinar one, two, three, four, five, and six. Um, so if you then head back out uh, to the shop page and view that, you have the default WooCommerce setup with your webinars sitting right in there. So um, very cool, fast features. Uh, it should help you guys get set up a lot quicker. Um, a lot more headache. The next thing we're working on is automated cron job updates for this stuff. So um, the refresh webinar uh, button is handy, but we'd like to get it set up where you can automate it even more. So that'll be the next thing uh, that we are working on. We'll push that out. Stay tuned on the Twitter feed, the website. Um, thank you everybody for using it and look forward to continuing to improve it. Don't hesitate to ask questions if you have them or run, if you run into any issues, post them on the support forum. Thanks and have a great weekend.